do, do you think the U.S. is meddling in Venezuela? I don't think so. I mean, we're, we're the superpower in the world. Part of the Russian agenda is to undermine democracy, not just in our country, but in other countries as well. Do you think it would be uh, meddling if Russia were to declare uh, Nancy Pelosi the president of the U.S.? <laughs> I haven't thought about that. She's not president of the United States, I'll tell you that. It's a pretty desperate situation over there, yeah. So we should be meddling, is what you're saying? Um, you know, the problem is when you meddle, you cause uh, locals to rebel against that, so uh, it's a tough call. Maduro's troops are goons went into the ghetto and decided they were going to take over. Isn't he the president of the country? I yeah. Mean, are those are his security forces. Well, so perhaps. Do you think the U.S. is meddling in Venezuela? Are they meddling? Um, yeah, both, both sides are meddling. But it's good meddling is what you're saying. Like I don't we should know if meddling. it's good meddling or not. I mean, any comment on the situation in Venezuela? Oh, goodness gracious. If this, um, as far as Venezuela is concerned, I think they did have a coup down there. Yeah. So, but what I like to see, yes. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I got to go. It is a coup. Yeah, it, 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 to me, when you have something like that happen, I think we got to do something about it, but I'm so sorry. I got to go. Okay, thanks. Would I classify it as a coup? Yeah. Happening? No, I wouldn't classify it as a coup. What, 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 how would you classify it? Well, I'll tell you it? what. I'd, I'd, rather, I'd rather be interviewed from a position of uh, uh, fact okay. rather than innuendo or opinion, especially since I just missed the briefing, which was just a couple hours ago. Do you think the U.S. is meddling in Venezuela's political system? I think it, we're just supporting the people and supporting what they are deciding to, uh, needs to be needs to happen. And, and so I think that's good for us since we are the bastion of freedom uh, to speak up and support other people around the world who are uh, crying for freedom as well. Well, I think uh, we need to protect the Mueller Commission. Yeah. We need to make sure that the Mueller Commission report is a public report. On, on the issue of meddling, do you think the U.S. is meddling in Venezuela right now in their political system? Um. I, I, you know, I, 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 do you think Trump is running a coup there? Do you think John Bolton and Rubio are running no, a coup? No, I don't. I, you know, I, 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 you know, I don't know. I think this is not against, you know, the girl who has been uh, awesome. Any comment on the situation in Venezuela? Do you think what's happening there is a coup? Uh, okay, I gotta go with Josh here. Uh, it's very, uh, Venezuela is not a good situation right now, and uh, the what's going on? Go. There. Go. Can any comment on the situation in Venezuela? Do you think it's a coup? No, 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 no. Any comment on the situation in Venezuela? Um, yeah, we're, we're working here. on her something. No comment, my friend. No good comment. to see y'all. Thank you. Been a pleasure. You know, I, I, it's really not my portfolio. The fact is, is that Venezuelans are starving See you later. today in an oil-rich country. So, do you uh, support the san do you support the sanctions, which will hurt ordinary people? Yeah, I, I'm I'm not going to take the bait. Okay, do you support friend. the sanctions? I'm, I'm done. Adios. Do you support the sanctions? Adios. Would, I guess I support. You, wouldn't that hurt ordinary people? Hurt I ordinary think people? I think we need sometimes to demonstrate that. Uh, Mr. Maduro has hurt ordinary people every single day. By sanctioning the entire country's economy, seizing its assets? Let me, let me say this about U.S. relationships in Central and South America and yeah. the Caribbean. Yeah. It is something that we should not be proud of. I mean, I look at the way uh, this country has treated Haiti, Haiti, Haiti for over 200 Aristide years. Aristide was an ally of Hugo Chavez in Venezuela, Jean Bertrand Aristide. Do you see this as a continuation of that policy of kind of neo-colonialism? Oh, for sure. Even with Cuba. Yeah. We've had an embargo on Cuba since 1959. This right. is tragic. Right. So do you and, think we should be embargo And they are 90 Venezuela? miles off our coast. So. Right. So should we embargo Venezuela at the same way? Absolutely and, not. And right. Why? Because then the population will suffer right. more. Right, right. No, I don't agree with that. So are you going to speak up on that? Because you clearly know sir, what time Sir, that's not my issue. Okay. My issue is financial services. All right. That's what I do. Thank you very much. Goodbye.